So if I were like an angry video game reviewer right now, I'd be like, I'd be like sighing and I'd say like, ah, I never thought <laughs> I'd play this game. Yeah, give me a second. Anyways, yeah, this is the downfall. So Mega Man X Legacy Collection 2. The game you really shouldn't buy if you just want to play good games, because these games! Ooh. Ooh. Well, I guess nothing to it, let's hit the A button and get right into Mega Man X5. Filter none, wallpaper nope. There we are. So, there's at least one cut in this game, meaning I'll get to save my throat once. And it's just the intro to the entire game, so. Mega Man X! Woke up in a capsule. Was feeling very Hanover. Suddenly there's Zero, who is not Mega Man X. What are you saying, game? The game. Ah, oh, whatever. So, it's pretty cool, like, uh, artworks of, like, all the X games up to this point. They're really selling this game to be the finale of the whole series. Which is weird, because they introduced so many new characters... ...that... Was a, like, they, they felt like they were gonna be mainstays, but they also sold it as, like, the finale. It's a very weird design choice, honestly. But, yeah, gee, I wonder who the winner's gonna be. <laughs> I really wonder. <laughs> Ah, oh boy. Well, that's pretty much the most animation we'll get out of this game. Everything else is static cutscenes with text. Because I guess they ran out of budget after X4. That's... this is where the budget went. It's just this this one this one SMFB cutscene. That's it. Nothing else. So Mega Man X5. My god. This game is certainly a thing. Because it was basic. It is the game level, uh, game speed. What? What, what can you say? The game speed? What? Button config should be X bus stop jump dash special. Is this the? It is. It is. Also welcome X flame. Uh, I'm sorry. Okay. This game is. It would. It would have been a little better. It would have at least saved my throat a bit. But you know. No. Thank fuck no more Duff McWay. I will get to that. Anyways, we do get to choose for the intro stage who our character is, but, well, even though we get to choose for every stage who our character can be, I'm gonna be doing two playthroughs either way to showcase every character in depth. So, for this stream, we'll be playing as Mega Man X. Maybe I'll do the training stage after, this, after the main game. We'll see. For now, his name is Duff. Well, it isn't. In the year of 21XX, Mega Man X, Episode 5. Yes, it's ready. Piece of cake. The colony is still alive. I can let it fall at any time. Please let me do it now. I'm getting bored. All I have to do is go back to the Earth and scatter the virus. You're exactly what I expected. You're doing a good job. <laughs> Nobody dares to fight against you, except those stupid Maverick Hunters. I'll do anything for you. Anything. Good. I'm going to Earth to execute our plan. Stay where you are and await further instruction. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what about the most mysterious? But I don't think you need to do it personally. Are they really a threat? I actually think you're really so strong that you can't let someone else do it. <laughs> yes, in the manner of speaking. Zero, I'll show you what you really are and who your true enemy is. <laughs> Ow. It begins, my throat dies. So, starting off, we start off with the fourth armor and it begins. This is Hunter Base. Can you hear me, X? Sigma appeared suddenly and moved towards the statue which is under construction. We have lost his train and haven't picked up any reading since. I've lost contact with Zero too. Where would he go? You can reach the statue by going straight in that direction. Stay alert, several machines, even some deserted taxis have become mavericks in the area. Be careful! 
So, before we do anything, so movement is the same pretty much. We can duck now! Which is fucking revolutionary. But yeah, that's pretty much it. So now, we just go on the intro stage, eh? Nothing fancy, just some stuff to wreck. Nice. Duck noises, yeah. Don't think there's any noise for ducking, so you know. And it begins again! What a terrible sight! The highway's been badly damaged! We've got to find Sigma before he destroys anything else, or we'll be in very serious trouble! Yep, we, we got it dropped again. So, let's hope that doesn't happen again, eh? Why do I, yeah, why do taxis have bus saws? That's what I don't get. But yeah, the plasma shot, pretty good for the start. Yeah. Like, even Amy Chien had to say something about this game. Amy gets again! This building is seriously damaged. The walls could collapse at any second. So trying to get trapped by falling rocks. You can take advantage of the lay of the terrain. Yep. At least it kills the enemies too. So yeah, don't get crushed. Also, you can do this. There we go. That's why the ducking is useful, I guess. We've made it really big in the time as I can still play. <laughs> nah. Can you see a red rope ahead of you? Jump and grab the rope carefully. Thank you. Yeah, this is the next new mechanic. We can be on ropes. Yay. Yay. Uh, you finally reached the statue. I've lost traces of Sigma and Zero somewhere above you. Be real that God system. There's the Sigma virus king the gods. Shh, I know the wall jump! And yes, as any Mega Man X intro stage, we have to climb walls before we get crushed, obviously. So there was like, what, five tutorial speeches from Alia there? <laughs> I'm already suffering, and it's only the intro stage. Uh. Oh, hey, Zero, you died. Zero, are you alright? I'm okay. <laughs> Just a bit of a bruised ego. Anyway, where's Sigma? He took off. Alias looking for him now, but can't pick up any readings. He's a virus. He can't be seen or analyzed correctly like other data. You have to feel his evil energy. That's the only way to find him. I see. Well, you should go back to the base, Zero. You can't find him in this condition. Uh, what was your title again? Do tell me. I can feel him. Sigma is close by. I'll leave here so as to not disturb you, but I'll check the surrounding area before I go. I can feel him too. Sigma is very close to us. Be careful, X. Yeah, he's closer than you think. He's right here. So, pretty short game. We're already fighting Sigma. You know? There he is. Looking chip as always. <laughs> Stupid Maverick Hunters! You will all feel the true Maverick power! Right before you die. So, flying head, evil flying embodied head of Sigma. Pretty simple boss, all things considered. Just very tedious and annoying. He, he really forces you to use your duck move, which is at least neat. So, yeah. Just kinda gotta hit him in the mouth while he's. Oh, he's very generous with his mouth attack today. But yeah, something I don't like about this game is how the health bar looks. It's way too scrawny. But whatever. Like, it's, it looks so tiny. But at least they... I guess it's because they wanted to make it scalable. They will have an actually interesting antagonist once you've killed him here. As if! Darn, that blast released the Sigma virus! It must have spread all over and could cover the earth by now. All of the replicants are getting severely infected. Sigma, he lost us on purpose. We have to evacuate immediately. The D S Hunter Ace. This is Hunter Ace. Do you read me? Are you all right? Any damage? Just a bruised ego. Are you all right? X zero. The entire Earth has been thrown into a panic because of the Sigma virus. It's dangerous to stay there. Report back to the base. Darn it, Sigma! You will pay for this. Even if we fight, what good? Shut up, X! The situation is far worse than expected. Sigma's explosion has spread the virus all over the Earth. Humans and Reploids are in total panic. What's worse, the space colony Eurasia is heading straight toward us. At this rate, it's going to crash into the Earth in 16 hours. Everything, including Reploids and the entire human race, will be annihilated. We have no choice. For the sake of the world, we must destroy the colony. But we only, the only weapon we have in the Hunter base that still works is the Enigma, and it's very old. 
We also have a space shuttle, but it's been affected by the virus and the autopilot function doesn't work. So we need someone to fly to the colony and let it collide. It's almost certain death, but we have no other choice. How's the condition of the Enigma? Far from perfect. In order to use the Enigma, we need to build it up with some devices. The Enigma doesn't work as is. Under the influence of the Sigma virus, a lot of Maverick hunters have become Mavericks and only a few hunters remain normal. Let's join forces with the rest of our brothers and complete the Enigma. Oh my god, this, these dialogues. So, we got dragged after each stage now. Just so I can feel even worse about myself, so that's great. So, let me just save very quick. Overwrite this piece of shit file. Sickness made of scrap from Colonel. I don't know why they look alike. We only have 16 hours left before the collision. We have to upgrade the Enigma before then. There are four Mavericks that have the devices required to enhance the Enigma. Crescent Grizzly has a crystal ball. Tidal Whale has hydrogen. Volt Kraken has an energy card. And Shining Firefly has the laser device. There's also four others for... Yeah, there's also four others for the space shuttle, but we don't care about those idiots. So, that was quite the dump of information, wasn't it? My god. My god. Anyways, uh... Uh... <laughs> oh, yeah, right. Yeah, we'll see. Uh, shut up, paint on that. So, the Sigma Head, also known as Intro Stage. It's kinda bad. Like, it was nothing. It was just a straight walk. It did introduce ducking in a weird, shitty way. And only gave you one rope you could easily skip to test out. And that sucked. Also, Alia. It's gonna be a recurring theme here, just Alia being Alia. So, if we hit the right button, we can look at the weapon, which is very useless. We can also just shoot the Enigma right now if we wanted to. Because, fuck if I know. Yeah, we can also get parts later. I still gotta place <laughs> That would be funny. So anyways, let's not kerfuffle and head into the first stage. We can play as unarmored X if we want. Or for our farmer X. Or zero. So just for shits and giggles, for the first stage, I'll play as unarmored X. Really doesn't matter. So here is Crescent Grizzly. Also known as, I think, Grizzly Slash in the original version. Also, shut up, Alia. Destroy the Maverick trucks, then reaches. <sighs> yeah, Grizzly Slash. So, all the Mavericks in this game, their original localized names were references to the band Guns N' Roses. Which is really weird and made all of their names sound hella awkward and shitty, in my opinion. We'll get to the worst ones. Also, shut up, Alia. Thanks for doing the counter explain. Oh god. Yeah. Yeah, might not be a best idea to go in as R now X. But whatever. Counter 2, hey! Nice, I got a counter. Ow. Okay. Yeah, I don't think R now X can hit it with a charge shot. But at least by ducking and hitting with a charge shot, we can just do this. There we go. Oh! How did. Ah. Oh god. It begins, my suckage. I don't know why I chose Arnold X for this, honestly. Might have been a mistake, but whatever. Wanted to just show that Arnold X exists and he is pretty useless and only useful if you want to do like high risk challenge runs or something. Which, fair enough. He sure X is health! There we go. Okay. Oh god. Okay, so health. That's a weapon, I should mean. So we could go up there, but we can't. There's just a shit ton of spikes up there, and we can't really do that yet. Yeah, and we get to that when we get to that. But for now, Unarmored X is the most useless shit ever, and you really should just go with Fourth Armor. Well, there's another reason why you would want to play as Unarmored X, and that is if you picked Zero during the intro stage. Because if you play as Zero during the intro stage, uh. X's 4th armor breaks and you cannot... Shut up, Alia. And you cannot use the 4th armor anymore. So... That's a thing. But in exchange, Zero gets the worst fucking weapon ever. The Zero Buster. He has to be completely stationary while using it. And it's pretty weak. Sub tank over here. There we are. And yeah, we cannot get the hard tank yet. Which means this game has a lot of backtracking in it. My god, I will complain about that too. I did... How did... 
Yeah, exactly, Entity. Just, oh, I will start with Zero next stream. But I won't play as X anyways then, so yeah. Also, SHUT UP, Elia! It's a dumb. So, over here we get the first armor piece, nice! Now, you might think I played as Arna with X to show off the armor piece now, but no. X, uh, we're having serious trouble again. It's like a nightmare for Reploids with the virus everywhere. It's too dangerous to equip the parts for enhancements as soon as you pick one! Therefore, I'll give you a data program for parts. Analyze and upload the data to your main memory in a secure area. Then complete the armor. For security reasons, the program is divided into four segments. Once you gather and upload all four parts, the armor will be complete. Nothing happens unless you have all four! Um, her name is Alia, isn't it? She can analyze the data and let you upload it. Anyway, here's the program for legs. With the leg part equipped, you can fly through the air and you are also invincible while flying. Collide against the enemy to destroy them. Get all the four programs and complete the armor. So, this is a way they could have made Armored X cool. You could have just gotten the armor pieces with Armored X, Armored X and just had them already. Test them out right in the stage. But nope! You just gotta collect all four pieces before you get your armor. Which is absolute. Like, I get it why you wouldn't be able to equip the armor if you already have the fourth armor equipped, but at least give Armored X something to do. Like, uh, it's so bad. So bad. Oh well, Maverick time. So, you are the famous Maverick Hunter. I never expected to see you. What an honor. We have no time to fight you. Just give me the crystal ball. The virus is already taking control of me. Soon I'll become one of the Mavericks. We're destined to fight anyway. Fight me when I'm still conscious. I don't want to waste you when the virus has taken control. I understand your situation, but we don't have time. Please understand. We're dealing with the fate of the entire Earth. We can't waste time fighting you. Everything is meant to be. No one can escape the destiny. I'm sure you know that too. Besides, it's party for mission, isn't it? Now, fight me, Maverick Hunter. So, Crescent Grizzly is definitely the one you want to start out with. Not only is he sluggish, big hitbox, and just an easy target. Yeah, that's pretty much why he's a good target. He he's just not that dangerous. He has like three phases. The second one is probably the most tedious because he just hides in the earth for a while. It just kind of is a dick. But you know, that's whatever. The voice actress for, was also in localization, I think she changed things for a bus, but at the time. Every fucking man for. Yep, that is true. Pretty much everyone already knows this fact, and yeah. Honestly, in hindsight, it's a stupid decision from the localization part. It just makes the name sound like ass. Like, absolute ass. Like, the, the original Japanese names are so much cooler. So, you know. That's that, I guess. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So. We, uh, yeah, we get rank. Total rank A, nice. You got the DNA data from the boss you have defeated. The special weapons become yours. The crypto weapon, everyone has hair. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, now we get to choose. Yeah, we got the Crescent Shot and the Crescent Sword. Crescent Shot, I'll go over once we get to the next stage. And we get the leg parts for the Falcon Armor. And the Crystal Ball, obviously. Crescent is Crystal Ball, should great increase the strength. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So, let's save. Yes. Alright. What? Incoming message from Sources Unknown. Who is this? I've never seen him. Nice to meet you, Maverick Hunters! I have no hard feelings toward you, but this is my mission! Before long, I'll attack the Hunter Base! Aw, a Mr. X and Mr. Zero there! Please play with me, I'm really bored! Don't worry, we'll fight like true sportsmen! <laughs> oh, I almost forgot to introduce myself! I am Dynamo! See you soon! How dare he, at a time like this? Should we even attempt to fight against one so arrogant? Yeah, I don't know. Right, Crescent Grizzly stage, let's see. Well, had a lot of explosions. And that's about it. 
Like the cave section at the end was pretty much just there so you could get the light capsule without it being awkwardly on a truck. Other than that, that was a really nothing stage. The escape section with the explosion was also pretty out of place. Yeah, like comparatively though, it's gonna go into low C for now, which looks like high C at the moment, but it's gonna it's low C. Trust me. Anyways, time for a stage that is gonna be the bane of my existence. Meet Tidal Whale. <laughs> also known in the original localization as Stuff McWhalen. What a shitty name! This stage starts off with a really s slow and annoying cutscene that you cannot skip, obviously. And a giant marine submarine is out to attack us. We can attack it, but it's not gonna speed up the auto-scroller in any way. So, yeah. We're pretty much just... Yeah, especially now it's just gonna be annoying. For the OG names? Uh, I don't know. So yeah, this is... The, 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 the entire stage is just an auto-scroller. Just an auto-scroller. Hello, Alexander. You came at the worst possible time. So meanwhile, I will show off Crescent Shot. It's kind of like Yamato Spear that it goes randomly, and charged up, it gives you a shield. So that's neat, I guess. Like it's not a bad weapon, honestly. Anyways. Yeah, but otherwise, eh, not too exciting. Yeah. Not much to say about this stage, other than it sucks massive ass and it's just... Oh right, I forgot it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, just... That's another thing about the fourth armor. It kinda makes the game a joke at times. Like... I got hit by a giant laser and only took like a tiny ass amount of health there, like... Really? Really? And look at this giant as health, but they have to kill now. And that's the annoying part about the plasma shot. It's uh, yeah. It's the manual is gonna actually to put in this. Oh, did they now? That's neat. Duff McKagan. See, that's where I fail because I have no idea about music and stuff. So all the references are just lost to me. Just told oh my god, can you just die? Die! Just die! Fucking hell. So you might think, great, we killed the submarine, can we just play a stage now? Nah, 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 but they just respawn. Ooh, so... Yeah. Might as well not even bother. If anything, I just wanna shoot it backwards a bit so I can actually slip past it. Without being too much trouble. Yeah. Yeah. There's health here, which I'll gladly take for my sub-tank. I don't know how I think about taking on Grizzly Slash. Uh, Crescent Grizzly first. You just get uh, a sub tank at the start, which is great. Also, something I didn't mention in X4, but you only carry two sub tanks now. Which. Yeah, I don't know why. Guess 4 were just too OP or what? I don't know their thought process behind that one. It's just weird. Anyways, not a slow, boring mid boss section here. It doesn't really do much for me. I guess hitting the middle of that is... Somehow I killed the top part How did I kill the top part first? I have no idea. 
whatever. So, yay. Yeah, there's a prototype version of this stage, which is not just a remix of Bubble Crab's theme. And it sounds actually pretty cool, I don't know why they didn't take it. Anyways, we actually get a real stage portion here! And it's... Uh -huh. I don't know. It just kinda is. That's all I can say about it, it just kinda is. Also... Gee, if only had a weapon that could be like a search snake. SPOILER ALERT! THAT'S THE WEAPON YOU GET FROM THIS FUCKING BOSS! MEANING, NO MATTER WHAT, YOU HAVE TO PLAY THIS STAGE TWICE! Actually, you have to play it THREE TIMES, because the hard tank is up top and you can only get that with the fucking Falcon Armor! Stages you have to go back to three times. Why the one with just all those crawlers? I know it. Like I don't want to rip off ABGN or something, but what were they thinking? Now you can do it with fact Now we could just fly up. Like <sighs> this is probably the one where I'll be going full ABGN mode the most next to like X8. Because like seriously, what a shitload of fuck. What were they thinking? <laughs> Honestly, no. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> and this is why I say X5 just slows you down at every step of the way. Like, oh, you want the fag now? Play the stitch twice, you fuckhead. Ugh. Ugh. I am, like, incredibly mad at this shit. Because it is something to be mad about. Because this is just bad game design. Oh, I think you have to just... Yeah, no, you're not. Yeah, this thing also has a shield. Hey, Emily. Welcome to my suffering. Welcome to me going full on AVGN on this shit. That's pretty much how it is. Like, I love how AVGN also reviewed this game. But... He didn't really go into the nitty-gritty of why this game is absolute garbage. I really wish he got deeper into it so that people could just see how bad this game actually is. But I guess that's just a pipe dream, eh? Whoa, that's a that's a weird screen shaker. I've never seen that before. Is that a legacy collection issue? It really seems like a Jesus. So I think I'll be dying to duff here once. But it's fine. Like, whenever I'm gonna be pissed at someone, I'm just gonna call them the, with their shitty names. Yeah, duff. So anyways, Tidal Whale... Honestly... Oh, welcome, X. I'd like to let us... I'd like you to let us use this ocean since it's the nearest to the hunter base. We need to produce large amounts of hydrogen. Do you intend to use it for... Nu Do you intend it for nuclear fusion? So, then you're going to use the old good old Enigma. Y yes if you know that, then please cooperate with us. X, I'm a man of the sea. And I will not allow you to use my sea freely. You might think I'm stupid, but you'll have to fight me. I understand. I accept your challenge. Why are you so pissed about Crescent Grizzly attacking you, but you're totally fine with it with da like whale here? Like, what? Ah, whatever. So, honestly, this fight ain't that bad. Like... He creates custom platforming challenges for you to get through, kinda, which is pretty interesting. You can get crushed by these, but honestly, it's fine. There are these also shoots a few misses around. He, to he gets totally blocked by his weakness though, so you know, that's kinda wank. Yeah, honestly, compared to the rest of the stage, this fight is a nice breath of fresh air. However, the second phase is a bit... I mean, it's a desperation phase, I guess, but yeah. Meh. <laughs> was it <laughs> Yeah, good old spiked wall, man. So, just because I like the boss fight a tiny bit, does not mean the stage gets any rain engine points. Let alone for the fact that you have to play it three times. 
Uh, also, shut up, Alia. Cosplaying as CPT. Uh, what? Oh, yeah, now that we got a few hours into the game, you can select weapons and life or weapons and energy. Uh, for X, I'll be going weapons and energy all the way. Oh, Captain, uh, okay. So, we got C shape. I don't know what that means. So, yeah, we can use the uh, hydrogen now, so that's neat. Save data. Yeah. Continue the game. Cool. Emergency! Uh, yeah. I still like some kind of sea dog thing. Anyways, tidal whale. No questions asked. Oh, from how. Oh, yeah, right. Now I remember. Yeah, now I remember. Okay. Emergency! Dynamo's attacking the hunter base! Fight back immediately! Oh. But the oh, can use the Chinese tongue twister names. So, great, Dynamo. Oh, okay. Fuck him up, I guess. Also, really half an hour in, and we're only two Mavericks in, which. Mmm. 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 Nice to meet you! You're ex, aren't you? The famous and persistent hunter? Who are you? And what do you want? Well, to stretch a point, I want to disturb what you're doing! Oh, don't worry, I just want to disturb you. I don't intend to kill you. But you wish to fight to the death, don't you? No, we don't! Well, if you fight me and die, then I'm sorry. But I'll play less than my best. Now, shall we let the battle begin? X? So, Dynamo! Honestly, you shouldn't have any problems with him. Unless you play an armor decks, then maybe. Or, like, look, he did like a pixel of damage there to me, which. Mm. Yeah, like, his patterns are a bit weird, so I'm like, kinda fast. But, really. You should not be having any troubles with him. I guess I can show off, uh... What's it called? C-Shave? Goo-Shave, oh, there we go. Yeah, it's pretty much, uh... It's like a search snakey thing, or plug ball. And charged up it does... This. Pretty cool. On Extreme Doing Food. Uh... Good thing I am not ranking the Extreme Mode, because... That one is just not balanced. Especially in X6. Like, my god. I have tried the extreme mode in X6 once. Never again. Never again. Never again. Okay, come on. Just triples the health of enemies. Oh yeah, that's what happens. So it's just a battle of, like... It just takes forever then. Great. Well, there we go. Eat shit, Dynamo. I mixed up. Uh, Seb, I think you're mixing up Dynamo with Dynamo, because Dynamo appears in X6 too. <laughs> Just as I thought, you are strong. You never let up. I'll retreat with this result. But I advise you to react a little, or you'll die from all the stress. Battle of Trition, yeah, that might be it. Well then, adios, amigo. Uh, I was... In X6. We also give some enemies new attack. Yeah, in X6 at least. Boy. Oh, yeah, now we get the energy up, which is cool. Because, yeah, you don't just get the energy up instantly, you have to wait an hour. So that's fun. I'm not ranking Dynamo because it's literally just a boss fight, which is so nothing that it doesn't really matter. Also, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do this right away, because I'll have to. At least! At least we don't have to do the third hour scroll and at least we only have to play it twice with zero but that still means i have to play the stage five times in two streams for 100 percent who thought this was a good idea again like why i i'm just baffled you know Easy mode is also a thing in X for what it changes. Probably just like less health for enemies and bosses, and maybe they do less damage. This game is a bunch of poopy ass drops. Yeah, whoever made this stage is a hurry cock sucker. Sucks cock. Oh, that's a. Well, that guy's dead. <laughs> he just spawned inside a fucking wall and couldn't get. Are you kidding? What was the point of that? Why was spawning there? <laughs> 
Yeah, that's actually a new mechanic in this game. Sometimes there are gonna be... Screw us, good. Sometimes there are gonna be Reploids that require your assistance by screaming help. And if you run into them, they say thanks and give you a 1-up and some health. Really barely a gimmick in this game, but in X6, oh boy is it gonna be a gimmick. Oh boy is it gonna be a thing in X6. <laughs> Let me tell you, that's gonna be the gimmickest gimmick of X6. I am dreading doing the X6 streams as well, because I don't know how long those will take. Yeah, 7 too, but in 7 I'm not gonna bother too much. Like, if someone dies, they die, but in X6 I'll probably be a bit more wary, because I don't know who needs what. Our ancient weapons are based on MIDI. <laughs> Download MIDIs. Okay. So yeah, now we get, like, that's another thing, like, we destroyed the fucking submarine. Why is it back? Like, I could understand the stage being an auto scroll for the first time. For the first playthrough. But afterwards, why is the submarine back? Couldn't you just let me rush through the stage to get what I need? And just... Uh, why would you design a game and stage like this? Like, at no point did anyone say, isn't this a bit boring or... Dumb? Did no one ever think to question the sanity of the game designers? Like, was this stage even tested once? Ugh. Like, just... Ugh. And I guess I can throw out one more at least. At least Alia shuts up once you've beaten the stage once on the save file. But the fact that I even have to give that a good point, like a mention at all, that says something. Like, couldn't Alia just be an option? Like a little thingy at the corner that you could press a button to activate? Does she have to interrupt your gameplay every time? And do you have to button mash through the text every time because it's just useless tat? Every time. Oh wait, X6 improved upon that. Who the fought? Mm. Jesus Christ. Oh my God, X, can you hear me? This is Alia. Shut up, Alia. I guess one nice thing I can say is that the color scheme of Goo Shaver is pretty nice. Like, I love this deep blue, it's pretty cool. Very lovely, actually. Alright, so... Yeah. I'm using the charge shot for this. Also, Zero cannot get this thing, so... Yeah. This is the program for the body part of the Falcon Armor. Analyze and upload the data to your... With the body part equipped, the damage you receive will be less. But don't overestimate the part or you'll regret. Thanks. Thanks. I'll be sure to visit this stage again in like... a bit. So, yeah, that's... Uh, where's my exit button? There it is. Oh, boy. So, yeah, now we got the body part for that. Safe, because I do not want anything to happen to this playthrough of this stage. Continue. Who pinged me twice? Who? 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 Good. Uh, <laughs> all right. Uh, okay. It's the fourth armor. Yes, that is exactly why it's called the fourth armor. <laughs> all right. Next up, the stage of Volt Kraken. I'll be going in as fourth armor X again, obviously. I gotta say, Volt Kraken is such a cool name! His, his, his official localization name is Squid Adler, which is just dumb. Anyways, uh... Ready? No! No, I'm not! You don't even get a grace period! Before the ready sign is even... Oh, whoops. Yeah, okay, I'll have to die. I'll have to die. 
Before the ready thing is even gone, you have to do a jump. Like, what? What madman designed this? So anyways, what you gotta do here is collect these glowy orb things. Because fuck you. There we are. Okay. Barely did that. Based on Stephen Adler, yeah. So yeah, I think I got all the glowy orbs. Hopefully. Also, this is sh slow as fuck. So, you know, great. Also makes no sense. Alright, proceed with caution. Yeah, I'm, I'm so scared of Dr. Light. It's probably the head part of the Falcon Arbor. With the head part equipped, you can use your special weapons using less energy. Now, take advantage of your enhanced special weapons and triumph. That's literally what the fourth arm already does. Why couldn't it be a single cutscene for the ball? <laughs> Honestly, though. Like, why couldn't you just throw one big ball at the end and just be like, okay, cool. So, anyways, we can all agree that right armor part sucks ass. So yeah, now we got get a lot of rapids here, and shut up, Alia! Now it's time for the most gimmicky gimmick to ever gimmick in a Mega Man stage so far. These slow as shutters. And I guess, uh, electric thingies that do a thingy. Sure. Sure. Is this number five now? Probably. Like, I've lost count of the Shut Up Alias. Yeah, these enemies are also annoying because they just have so much health and just always in the way. So anyways, these Shut Up Alias! So yeah, these shutters are just slow as fuck. You can't rapid hit them or anything. You gotta, like, wait for them to recede, then hit them again, then wait for them to recede again. And there we go. It's really tedious and... If this gimmick was done a bit better, I feel like this could be cool and like actually puzzly and neat, but as it is, it's just slow, annoying, and eh. It's just horrible. Anyways, time to pretty much get all the one-ups I could ever need. Because lol spam. Spikes! Because yes. And yeah, you can't just work on one and then the other. Because they go back out after a while if you don't tend to them, so you know, that's just great. Yeah, I'm just not gonna bother with these guys anymore, because fuck them. Anyways, uh, there's just spikes up there, so we can't do anything there yet, so we'll have to come back with something later. You'll see what I mean once we get there. Okay, I think, there we go. So yeah, this is just a tedious gimmick. At least it doesn't overstay its welcome too much. But my god, this stage is a dumpster fire. <sighs> and it's time for a pretty brutal electric boss if you're going on armored, obviously. Other than that, every boss is a fucking joke. Volt Kraken, will you do me a favor? This is how you greet me after so long? No, nice to meet you again, or I'm sorry, not even a hello? How rude, you have not changed at all. I'm sorry about Launch Octopus. I wasn't referring to such an old story. You destroyed it because you're a Maverick Hunter. It's your duty. Your mission. Well, I got fed up with the Hunter jobs. That's why I quit. Not because of Octopus. Please, we have little time left. Give me the energy cartridge. You are free to take such a worthless thing. But what a simpleton you are. Even if you get it, you can't change the fate of the Earth. Heavy Raptor's been infected by the virus and become... Meh. 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 No, he has been infected too! Woohoo! Ravik Hunter! He'll be terminated! Just like you did too, Octopus! Octopardo! So, Volt Kraken is. He loves to move around! And. He has a pretty similar weapon to Elekman's. The special weapon you get from Elekman, just that it travels on the floors and stuff as well. If it hits that. But yeah, like, his moving around is also very annoying, and he spawns that, makes the floor electric, follows you around a bit. But you forget how to translate. Yeah, how do you even translate? Oh yeah, he made the floor. Yeah, great. He made the floor ground. I am losing my mind here. 
I think he also has a desperation move where he like covers. Yeah, there we go. You wanna stay here, otherwise you probably will get hit by that attack. Oh, yeah, like that. Uh, oh, and this is like an electric block that also does. Uh, yeah, okay. I think you get the force fight. It's very hectic, but not that bad. Just don't go in on out. Worst mistake of my life. <laughs> So yeah, that's a thing, isn't it? All right, yeah, 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 yeah. So his blocks are stuck one frame, really. So once again, weapons and energy, and we get Tri Thunder. And the energy cover, cause yeah, ba 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 ba. Okay, safe, 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 safe. Yes. Continue. Lovely. Okay, so who who dares to ping me again? Right, so maybe goes just straight up cracks your personal rules, everything makes you completely different. I don't know, like it's weird, the writing in this game is weird. Anyways, Vault Kraken stage, uh Yeah, um It's better than Tidal Whales That's all I'll give it Honestly Alright, next up Shining Firefly, also a really cool name. That's just direct. I guess that could also be. Like, it's never really explained how the virus affects someone, I think. Easy Glow, yeah. This one sucks, I was doing thing. So, this stage is probably the most notorious for, like, Aelia being Aelia. Anyways, Try Thunder, yep, yeah, pretty much that. Charged up. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of underwhelming. Anyways. Shut up, Alia. Based off Izzy Strabin. So we got some Mets here. Pretty nice, pretty nice. So Econ here and right there. Yeah, I mean, it's the Mega Man series. What do you expect? Shut up, Alia. So the annoying thing about this stage is... It could have really great flow to it, but Alia just keeps jutting in and being a nuisance. Cause like these chandelier spike things are nice and like, come on, like, uh. Ooh, it's finally time to talk about this. The Sigma virus is here and slowly coming towards me. If you get hit by that, that normal thing at the bottom will slowly go into the danger zone. And if it goes like full virus, I think you take a shit ton of damage with X. So, you know. Don't get hit by too many Sigma viruses. Like, getting hit by one or two is totally fine, but don't get hit by too many, or else you will take a lot of damage. That's pretty much it. And I think if you go to, through a sub area load, the virus level resets, so yeah. There's a lot of stages, like a few stages at least, that don't have enough Sigma viruses floating around for you to eat shut up, Alia, for you to even get infected fully? So like, what's the point? <laughs> Such a wasted gimmick as well. Anyways, just blast open the door and yeah. Again, this stage could have had such great flow to it, the first part. But no, Alia just keeps shutting in. So, remember that one section from uh, Split Mushroom stage? Yeah, this is just a different angle. With a mid boss this time around as well. Hit the black head thing, whatever that is. This hurts my. <laughs> so, yeah, this is once again a very tedious thing. And no, the black one doesn't always spawn on the bottom. There's, I'm just getting lucky and don't have to bother doing anything. Is everyone gonna just spawn on bottom now? It's actually a part that makes it so you have to take my music and infect it. So it makes the mechanic even more... Oh yeah. Parts. Parts. Mm -hmm. Certainly a thing. We'll get to parts eventually. Once the game decides it wants to hand out some. Which is also dependent on how many hours are left in the game. So... Just make the gimmick even less accessible to anyone playing the game normally. It's just fucking weird, man. Anyways, let's get out of this area. Yoink. 
Oh, oh, oh da, 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 da. <sighs> Alia, I'm getting hit now. <laughs> Thanks, Alia. Fucking bitch. Because parts of your, yeah, when your rank is above, which is weird. But then again, parts are useless in this game. I never needed parts here. Anyways, uh, pretty cryptic here. You gotta use Crescent Slash to get through this. To get the arm part. This is the powerful part of... Uh, with the arm part, you can maximize attack with your original shot, but you can't charge the special weapons! Uh, why? 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 Uh. That's like one reason I wouldn't want to use this because I want to show off all the charged special weapons, but whatever. X5 moment. Alia, most of silicone 2. Siliconia. I got some Sigma heads fallen on me because that's always fun. I think there might actually be enough. Shut up, Alia. There might even be enough Sigma heads in here to actually pose a bit of an issue, but. Eh. But they are so slow that it's barely a problem. Also, that was smooth. That was smooth. Did I... I think I did? Like, I always save, I think. Probably. I don't know. So, put the Let's Kill Viruses. <laughs> so useless. How dare you bust up my lab! This laboratory is so badly infected by the virus, there's no other way for me to enter. <laughs> you hunters always do that. My work is not for Maverick hunters. I've never trusted your approach. Therefore, I will cooperate with you. Doctor, I don't have time to argue with you. Please understand. My body has already been infected too. I realize I may have been wrong, but it's too late to change now. I've made up my mind. Now, let me rest in peace. So, Shining Firefly is a bit annoying to fight because he just keeps teleporting all around the dang place, so you can barely get a good shot at him sometimes. Also, he spawns these things which kinda follow you around. Oh, you yeah, know, that's a thing. Uh. Uh. Oh, come on. And then he does his funky laser attack, because why not? And like the more damage he takes, the faster he gets. So you know, that's that's something. Just makes him even harder to hit. But really, this is a very non-boss fight. Like you, it really shows that he just wants to fucking die. So uh, that's great. Oh no, I I just remembered the rocket tunnel. Oh, no. Ah! That is the next stage. I mean. Since then, it said. Oh, the noise is just away. Yeah. Yeah. It's weird. Anyway, blah, 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 blah. Weapons. Ah, oh, yeah, this. The plus means we get parts now. But at the same time, it's a. Uh, it takes forever for the parts to actually get delivered, so, you know. Firefly laser. Let's go. Cool. And the Falcon armor is complete. Alright, let's save. There we go. And before we launch the Enigma, let's just rank Firefly stage real quick. Honestly, it gets brought down by Alia a lot. The flow of the stage can be fun if you replay it. But why would you once you get, like, all the things in there? But I guess... I can give it a D, at least. Because... It's not as bad. There's some good stuff there. At last, the Enigma has been completed! It's old, but we reinforced it with some devices. It should work fine. Well, we're ready! The time has come at last. We're going to launch the Enigma! The fate of the Earth depends on it. The energy, the power, the angle, everything is clear. Alright. Blast off! Blast off! Blast off! Blast off! <laughs> Last off. And we failed. Which is fine. 
Only destroyed 62%. So yeah, that's the failed cutscene, which is honestly fine. I expected that. It can happen that it works this time around, but really doesn't matter. Curses. The enemy was not successful. We have a backup plan. Let's concentrate on the next move. We will execute the shuttle operation. Blast off, blast off. <laughs> I have seen it work a couple times, but it's it's kind of rare. So last hope, the space shuttle operation. Shuttle will approach and fly into the colony. The pilots will eject at the last minute. It's very dangerous because they could get sucked into the blast. In the end, I feel that this will fail just like the Enigma. We need to get as many devices as we can to strengthen the shuttle's power. But the autopilot function doesn't work. Okay, get as many devices as you can. We'll try to upgrade it from here. It's the last chance for us. I know this mission is hard for you, but the point thing is next to the mistake. Now let's get back to work. Oh, that's a diversion. Oh. Alright, space shuttle stuff. The next four idiots are Spike Rose Red. He has the auto engine. Burn Dino Rex has a booster. Spiral Pegasus has an orbiter wing. And Dark Necrobat has a fuel tank. So, before we do any of that, let me just finish my suffering real quick. And I guess we show off the fall Falcon armor. So, yeah. And she's the server official. Really? Because huh? I've seen it change if I just reload the save. So, I don't know. Maybe different versions do different things? I don't remember. Anyways, the Falcon armor has a piercing shot. Oh, hey, man. And, yep, yeah, you can just fly all around, pretty much. It has a bit of a limited, like, time to it. But you're pretty much invincible to, like, actually enemy collision during the flight. And you actually kill enemies there. So that's pretty fun. Also, something you may not have noticed before, but we cannot shoot through walls anymore. Which is why the piercing shot of the Falcon armor seems like actually a thing that might you want. Still weird, but meh. Meh. Alright, let's just... Lock you back a bit. Alright, I guess while we're here... Oh, ri I, right, I cannot show this off because I do not have the 4th armor anymore. Well, there's gonna be one fortress stage where I can show off the 4th armor, I guess, so that's why we're doing that. Has it cheese metal? Oh, okay, nice. Well, again, it, it really doesn't matter because I'll just roll with the punches. Especially in the X playthrough, whatever happens, happens. For the zero playthrough, I might have to improvise if something goes awry, but I don't care at the moment, so eh. I'll just keep like a safety safe ready or something. I don't know. <sighs> like, I'm growing so fucking numb to this stage already, it's horrible. At least with zero, you can speed the stage up a tiny bit. Bad ending central. <laughs> that would be funny if I got that. Just the funniest shit, but I don't think it's gonna happen. I, I, I'm feeling like the shuttle will work, because for me it usually always works. Like, I don't think I've ever actually seen the bad ending happen to me. Unless I actually tried to get it to happen. <laughs> By just launching them prematurely, so, you know. That's a thing. And believe me, I've played this game a lot. Which is why I hate this stage with such a fucking passion. Kind of says it's be... It's not, it's less than that. Yeah, like the percentages are all screwy. Did she do get bending? Will you pull up a YouTube video? Maybe. 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 But maybe I'll forget. Because <laughs> that's prone to happen with me sometimes. Especially when I grow so numb to a game after playing it. I'm just complaining the entire time. Because my god, this stage. My god, this stage. Right. Well, it's another of Pika having quite a fortunate end of the Barken. That never happens. Extra better than fact, never earlier than the fourth armor. I guess they just wanted the shitty armor first. Although, to be fair, I don't dislike the Falcon armor. I really like the fact that you can just fly around and all that fun, fun stuff, but... 
Compared to the 4th armor, it just feels like a downgrade in some spaces. But I mean, it is kind of necessary to use the Falcon armor for some of the later stages now. At least if you want to get some parts for the second armor you can get in this game. Because yes, there's a second armor in this game. And it sucks horrible ass. Trust me. The second armor you get in this game is absolute garbage. Its only purpose is to get some hard things. That's it. That's really it. And some of those hard things you can even get with just a fake armor as well, so... <laughs> you know. Is it a black one? Uh, no, that's the Shadow Armor in X6. But to be fair, the one here is also kinda blackish, so... Me. Me. And again, me. Okay. Go away. Alright. So now we just kinda fake an armor wave up here. Do like a pseudo air dash through here. And I think this might be our first hard take in the run, which is kind of embarrassing. But there it is. Get the zero audio locked out of fucking shit. That is true, and it sucks. It sucks. But I mean, what else is new? Alright. Uh, yeah. 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 Okay, so I could get the hard thing in Shining Firefly stage now, but there's another thing that I can't get yet, so not gonna bother. Anyways, it's time to head to Dark Necrobat stage. Honestly, another really cool Merrick name. I think his localization name is Dark Easy Dizzy. Based on like Izzy Glow, I think. I think. Yeah, probably. Duck. Dizzy Reed, alright. So, no, my game is not. My game is not chugging because of bad performance or anything. This lag is intended whenever this black hole appears in the background. See, now the game is running fine again. And now it's lagging again because the black hole is there. Alright, Izzy Glow. What is this JoJo talk? So yeah, the gimmick of this stage is that these constellations appear and spawn the batons and sometimes also spikes and like, yeah, the black hole spawns constellations which spawns bats later and it's... It's actually even slow. <laughs> what even is slow mode? Is, does it just slow down the game for no reason? I don't know. But also, I just don't get why there's just this lag. It just throws you off, doesn't it? Like. Shut up, Elia! Like... It's like... I think you go... Yeah, okay. Like, it's just so weird. Like... Oh, this is just great. Yeah, thanks, game! What the fuck? I think those spikes are insta as well, so that's just... That's just great! Because the game is better than... Yeah, like... like that's one of the worst mechanics, because... Yeah. Anyways, Falcon Armor way to get... Subtank. There we go. That's section one. Really bad. Put it in the trash. Now, section two is... Well, you remember, uh... Cyber Peacock? It's pretty much Cyber Peacock again. Now, shut up, Alia! So yeah, you just flip the stage up to down again. It's fine. Trash bet. Yeah, just. Oh, I didn't even get hit by the sick, but I leaked my virus. Okay. Cool. So now we just kind of. Oh no, I I wanna flip it again. There we go. Oh yeah, this is where I can infinitely respawn the sigma virus, so that's fun. Yeah, there's a hard tank. I think what I wanna do is just get take a hit because I don't know how to get this otherwise without doing anything. Some balls. Always good. Somehow I dodged that. <laughs> what does changing gravity summon the world? I don't know. I wish I knew. Ah, oh, dang it. Danger, danger zone. Alright, time for the worst fucking thing in existence. This puzzle.
There we go. And the best part is you can't even just use the charged up shot of that. You have to guide it through there. <clears throat> this is the program for the head part of the Gaia armor. As I would, uh, 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 uh. Yeah, the head part of the Gaia armor does nothing. It does nothing. And yes, I love how they put spikes so you can just give yourself to rich one. It's they knew this puzzle sucked. They knew it sucked. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I gotta try to rack an accent like a bad accent there. Squeak! I've been waiting for you. Hey, can't you understand the urgency of our present situation? There's no time to fight. Squeak! Who cares? I don't take orders from anyone. The word Sigma means nothing to me. I'll destroy all Mavericks like you. Squeak! I'm always ready. Yeah, I tried. So, Dark Necrobat is... Well, he's pretty much like if a baton were a boss fight. And kind of like coupled with Shade Man. Because why not? He just flies around a lot, does some swoopy. I yeah, he oh he does heal himself. I don't did not remember that. Okay, cool. He also has like another attack, which is pretty neat. Not that one, but it does feel nice to just blow through a giant row of batons. So that's fun. So you're gonna do the attack or not? Yeah, there we go. Giant shock waves. Oh, I think he was also supposed to like stop time there, but I kind of stopped him. Well, next goes Weasel, Necrobat goes Slurp. <laughs> so, all in all, not a bad boss fight, just kind of underwhelming. But still, not bad. Another thing I noticed about X5 so far, the boss fights aren't bad. They're just alright. When you stop his time stop. Yeah, I get fucked. Alright, ba 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 ba. So energy up again. And we get Dark Hold, which is just a time stop. And a shot eraser for zero, which I'm not gonna be using, so that's cool. <laughs> Fucking aced. Okay, save that. Continue. Oh. I've been fighting a Sigma virus for a long time. It is the it is the virus that causes all Raptors to transfer into Magrits. The most dreadful virus to ever exist. Why? I wonder why I'm not harmed. Instead, I feel energy growing within my body. What on earth is happening to me? I have a bad feeling about this. That's all of the report on Zero. Zero has fought Sigma several times. I believe he has the virus antibodies. It's possible. He doesn't react negatively to the virus. His power output is actually growing. For the most part, the body systems of X and Zero remain mysteries. I can't predict what will happen. I suggest you take measures. Keep this secret. I think I'll figure it over. His power is growing with the virus. It's too dangerous to keep them loose. Please, at least do something about Zero before it's too late. Menacing. So. If you had chosen life, you got a five shot, which is great, you know, but it's fine. So, Dark Necrobat stage, the first section sucks, the second section is meh, so E. Right, next up Spiral Pegasus. Let's go. I think his name in the localization is the Sky. Yeah, exactly, the Skyver. Which is like, eh, bad. This theme is rockin' though, gotta, gotta, gotta say, it. I like this theme. Supreme power. Shut up, Elia. Yeah, Elia, there's a bomb, I destroyed it already. Yeah, this is the game of this stage pretty much for the first part. Oh god, the, yeah, destroy the bombs or you take shit ton of damage? Unless you have iframes, I guess? His name is... The sky boy, isn't it? Is 
So yeah, if Alia didn't interrupt the entire time, this would actually be a fun little challenge with the bombs there. Maybe give the bombs a bit more time before they explode, but other than that, it's fine. At least they only start to count down once they reach the screen. So, you know, it's fine. But then we kind of bog it down with... Yeah, this little thing. Based on Michael High in the Sky Monroe. Which, yeah, okay, that's pretty stupid. Yeah, Spiral Pegasus just sounds cool. Also sounds cooler than fucking Pegasolta Eclair from Zero Four, which... I'll get to that one eventually. Weapon tank here, if you wanna really risk your life for something that's really not worth it. <laughs> Whoa, okay, hey guys, let's let's calm down here. Okay. So now we just ignore this rest of the section. And gee, I wonder where the armor part is in this stage. Oh, here it is. Yay. For the body part of the guy armor. With the body part equipped, that damage you'll receive will become less. This is starting to sound like a very boring armor, Dr. Light. W red tank is... That is true. NM0 style. That would be interesting. Hey Zing, what's up? Doing good? Having fun? Doing good? Yeah, me too. Is there a jungle stage? Just you wait, don't- no one say anything. No one say anything. About jungle stages. Ziggy. <laughs> yeah, my main man Ziggy. Yeah, the- like, there- there is dialogue for all the capsules as zero, but it's sometimes just not right. Because they never intended you to reach that, so it's just kind of like they didn't bother. It's probably just placeholder dialogue in there anyways. Well, I'm not sure what the plans for the zero hard tank, what the plans for the zero critical ranking season are yet. Like, I don't know what season three will hold for the art. Like, honestly, like Reploid chess might just work still. That's the thing. She might just still work. Because like, it, it doesn't really change, does it? Big guy. No. Let's make her eyes massive as <laughs> X, I've wanted to meet you. But considering the situation, we don't have time for small talk. Soon the Replif Force's air wing will fall. You may be only hope. But you'll have to convince me first. Through battle. Seth loves you. Well, if Seth wants to give it a shot, I ain't stopping the man. But I ain't forcing the man either. So, Spiral Pegasus is all about, like, moving around and trying to knock you off the stage. Because, yeah, we're fighting above a bottomless pit, which is a pretty cool thing, honestly. Oh, God. And that's why you might want to choose the Falcon Armor, because... You can at least save yourself a bit, maybe. Yeah, now he does this, which is very Storm Eagle-like. Oh god, burn on that. And yeah, now you can just kinda hang out below him and he won't be able to hit you. I think those tornadoes knock you off the stage too, so, yeah. Ow. Come on. Actually, let me show his weakness. Once he goes back to, like, the ground or something. Come on. Ah, fine, I'll do it here. Yeah, he is weak to time stop. That's it. So I guess in a sense we're using Salvador. Also, this time stop weapon is very weird because this is the only weapon that does not change if you charge it up first. So, yeah. Weird. Weird! Fucking weird. Okay. Uh, energy. Energy up. Did the charging? I don't remember it being that way. I think it was just the same time. I think it just didn't do anything. So weird. Weird. 
Emergency! Yeah, it's Dynamo again. Before we do that, let's see what Spire Pegasus stage did. Like, the bomb gimmick wasn't bad. It's interesting. That one, like, there were two auto scrollers there pretty much, which bogged it down. But, three auto scrollers actions, actually. My god. Honestly, only the big one. Big one was solid. Yeah. Yeah. Emergency, Dynamo's come back here to attack. What on earth does he want? Well, it doesn't matter, we have to fight him. Yes. Yes. Ah, for a farmer, why not? Might as well show off the weapons we didn't show off yet. With the chargey shots. So, yeah, depending on where in the story you are when you fight Dynamo, the background actually changes. Nice to see you again. Did you miss me? Stop pestering me, Dynamo. What do you want? I told you. I want to disturb you. That is my mission. It may not seem it, but it's my job. And since you guys are always so serious, I'm a little serious too this time, okay? Ready to die? So, uh, let's see. What weapons did I... Uh, the Firefly Laser. Charged up it... Oh, so yeah. Charged up it's just the giant laser that does a thing. And Dark Code doesn't do anything, so. Wing Spiral is actually Dynamo's weakness. Kinda awkward to hit him with that though. Because, yeah, it's. Yeah, there we go. So, let's see what it does charged up. I said, let's see what it does charged up. It's just a forward tornado, I guess. Yeah. That's pretty much it. A bad ending, but it looks like it's probably just like Eurasia crashing, like being crashed and stuff. That's that's what I think it was. Oh come on! There we go. So yeah, that's how you kind of cheese Dynamo. Oh, there we go. So you can move yourself down. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I feel like they were just kind of winging all these weapons. Get it? Wing. So, you are strong. I fought seriously this time. Anyway, I need nine lives if I stuck with you. So, I'll leave. No more games. You should think about your future too, or you'll die someday. I'm getting out of here because I don't want to die right now. Adios! Dynamo! What a dick. Die. Yeah. 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 Virus Buster. Yes, I think I can kill viruses now if I really wanted to. I do not care. Yes. Okay. Uh, right. Next up is Burn Dino Rex. Not a really cool name. I think in the. Original, it was... Matrix. Yes, Matrix. <laughs> Which is based off something else. Anyways, this stage is one of the more notorious ones with Alia being a shithead. You'll see why. So starting off this section is not too exciting, it's just a lot of, like, dragons spewing some fire if you let them. Which, you know, I'm not letting them. Ow. Metzorum. Pick energy plus. I I mean with X I'm always picking energy plus, so you know, don't worry. Anyways, uh Alia, shut up. Alia, shut up! And time to be fast. Cause there is a hot tank here. And now we probably die. Shut up, Alia. Shut up, Alia. Yeah, I've had a time happen where there was the, the lava was already on screen and Alia was just like, Hey, get to the safe spot. I was like, if you had shut up and not stopped me in my path, I probably could have, but... Uh. So, yeah. There's another section that just 
It's slow. You gotta wait for the lava to subside to burst through some walls for you. It's just tedious. And there yeah, the lava is insta kill in case you're wondering. So, you know, that's just great. It looks cool, yeah, but it's boring. It's boring. So, you know, I'm just gonna hang out here now. There we go. Also, Ada still doesn't know when to shop, so yeah, let's just blast through this before we. Okay, before I die. Woo -hoo -hoo. Woo -hoo. So, uh, put on your sunglasses because it's. Shut up, Ada. Shut up, Ada! <clears throat> so, put on your sunglasses because it's about to get hot. Yeah, the right armor returns and. Somehow we can survive in lava if we are in the right armor, even though our shitty ass head is poking out still. Yeah, I don't get it. Seven times in less than five minutes. Yes! Because this stage is so bad with Alia being a shithead. Like, you've seen how many times she talked there. Like, it's ridiculous. So, yeah, I think we wanna go up now. Yeah. Oh, whoops. No, we did not want to go up there. Let's see. Should have made a glass cover. Oh, that would be nice. That would be a nice little touch for that. But I guess they just didn't care to make a new sprite. Because this game had to come out soon and they were rushing it like any Mega Man game ever. Like, I don't get why every fucking Mega Man game had to be rushed out beyond belief. It's horrible. It really is the problem with Mega Man games. Like, if they just put a little more time and effort into them, they wouldn't be this bad. But nope. Nope. Okay, so you wanna go down here. That's... that's... okay. Is there any game that wasn't rushed? Yeah, honestly, probably not. Come on, just jump up there. Get up there. There we go. Okay. Okay. I think... yeah, there we are! I once had a glitch with Zero happen here where I could control Zero and the right armor at the same time. It was weird. The arm part of the Gaia armor. With the arm part equipped, you can attack with the Gaia shot. While the range of the Gaia shot is short, it's powerful and it can neutralize the enemy's energy bullets. Also, you can break a certain brick. Yeah. Next one wasn't rushed? Oh. Hm. Interesting. So, yeah, that's almost the Gaia armor complete now. And yeah, I can just skip the rope puzzle there. Yeah. Puzzle. Legend is one reason for but they ended up releasing it far too early. So it was rushed. Brick by brick. Hmm. No <laughs> bricks. Just one. Yeah, only one. Oh, I gotta do a Bowser voice for this guy. Why have you come this far? I want your booster engine. I have evidence that this is a secret warehouse for weapons. You know what's happening to the Earth. Now give it to me. Yes, whatever you say. That's what you expect to hear from me, right? You don't know nothing. No, you know nobody will obey like that, don't you? So why don't you fight as always and force me to give it to you? That's it. You have the guts. That's oh, that's if you have the guts to. <laughs> why do replets always have to fight each other? Hee hee hee, Come, it's time to do what we do best. Let's fight and enjoy ourselves, just like always. Ah, uh, boy, X. So, yeah, Burn Dino Rex is oddly agile for a fucking huge honker. Shoot some fire that has some fire debris out, and yeah. Shut the hell up, X, you whiny bitch. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, his jump is like really fast, which is weird. And yeah, he does like a huge little dash at you. Well, during the stage, I think he's invisible, so that's fun. Uh, yeah, then he hangs on the wall, kind of like Neon Tiger, and shoots at you. It started in X1, my man. Like, in the ending of X1, he was already like, Why must Raplites fight each other? Like, this man, this fucking idiot of a fucking robot. Oh, jeez. Uh, yeah. He always did that. Okay, that's a good attack. X is just a fucking idiot. Also, that hit animation from him is really weird. <gasps> yeah.
Yeah! Let's see if he doesn't know when to stop dying. Yep. Yeah. He's surprised to die. <laughs> he really is. Alright, let's get energy plus. And we get ground fire. Ooh, speedster. That's actually a nice thing. Speedster is probably one of my favorite parts in X6, so that's fun. <laughs> right, uh... So, burn Dynarex stage. I mean... The ideas were not bad. Also, Alex, don't forget, the parts take like a few hours to get ready, so... That that speedster part was like from a few stages back. <laughs> so don't worry, we're gonna get the part he wanted. Anyways, um... I, I guess slow D because the right armor section wasn't that bad, just kinda hard on the eyes. Alright, it's time for the last stage, and it is... Uh, fuck it Spike Rose Red. Also known as Axel Rose, I think? Anyways, check this out! There's guns and roses in the background! Hey! 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 Axel Red, alright. So, you know. Also, these are the bricks we can destroy with guy armor, so, you know. Also, the fact now which pretty much just ignores the entire stage. Which is sad, because this stage isn't that bad. Just kind of short. There's a lot of, like, gotcha moments with the vines here, though, which is kind of annoying. Just gotta really watch out for that one straight pixel that pokes out. Yeah. Yeah, I wonder who, who, who this name is based on. Gee, I, I, I wonder. Alright, let's just yoink over here. Shut up. Axe Rose. Oh. Right, you gotta hold up there if you're falling down. I forgot how cool I am. Oh, silly me. Oh. Oh, how could I ever forget that? Oh my. Oh my god. Alright, anyways, uh, you wanna go up here. There we are. Uh, this, is armor. this is an armor prototype that I created a long, long time ago. I named it Gaia Armor. Gaia Armor specializes in defensibility. It is very heavy and lacks mobility. He won't be able to use weapons! I'm just gonna let it sit for like a second. Yeah. Still, it will be very useful because you will be able to walk on the damaged area. With this armor equipped, you'll be able to reach places that you have never been able to before unless you use the Falcon Armor. Yeah, this is the antithesis to what Mega Man is. It, this literally removes the main selling point of the early Mega Man games, the special weapons. That's the cool thing about Mega Man. And they just remove it. It's just gone. Like, why would you do that? <sighs> <laughs> really, the guy is just a utility to get some stuff and then never be used again. That's it. What do you want with me? Nothing. <laughs> Thank you, X. I just want the orbit engine. Are you a thief or something? You can't just take what you want that easily. Go home, kid. Otherwise, I'll call the Mary Hunters. Oh, I'd love to see him do that. Like, he'd just call them up and X's phone would ring and he'd be like, Hello, Mary Hunters. <laughs> <laughs> do as you wish. Your X knows. Now, tell me where the engine is. I told you. You can't get it so easily. You have to fight me for it. If that is the easiest way to persuade you, so... What is with X this game? He's got like these heavy mood swings of like, Oh, I must be ready to... And I'm like, oh, sure, sure, I'll fight you. Hey, you better watch your mouth. I'll do whatever it takes to win. Let the battle begin. Hello, <laughs> base department is for you. So, he starts with a creating clone that just instantly goes away and then you can hit him. Really weird. 
I don't know. Just a really weird way to start the battle. Also, he like, creates a lot of these spike balls. Ah, whatever. Okay. Oh, okay. It's just going crazy, yeah? Oh my god. It's like Gemini Laser, but on crack. Jesus. Yeah, then he creates a clone of himself, which you gotta figure out which one is the real one. I guess. And then he just does a huge whip, which... This is pretty much more than half the battlefield. X is both winding and completely done with everything. I know it's... Oh god. It's the worst. Rose person is still in our ribbon. No, no, just... just stupid. <laughs> yeah, I think he's just stupid, honestly. I shoot some rose petals, which is pretty neat. So yeah, like Gemini, he doesn't crash the game logic. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh my god. So yeah, we're just very based today, huh? Oh, we reached SA rank, that's cool. Uh, energy plus again, spike ball. Uh, energy of Gaia armor. Okay, safe. He's a Lula, so he's going. He's just dumb. <laughs> uh, fucking idiot. We've completed the space shuttle. It's ready to launch at any time. Still, the problem is who will maneuver it. It's awkward having this kind of problem at the very end. Everything else is taken care of. Shuttle is ready. Let me know once you've dealt with this pilot issue. The space shuttle. Stand by. I trust you, Zero. I'm sorry I couldn't do more for you. Don't mention it. This is my mission. I'm the only pilot left, you know. Zero, I'll do it instead of you. No, X, I wanna die. Who else will protect you off? Don't talk as if you won't be back. I'm sure I'll be back. I won't die on such an e- <laughs> When I become a Maverick, I think that's when I'll have died. Okay, Zero, I'll be waiting for you. You better come back alive or I'll kill you! It's about time, Zero. Okay, I'm ready. Blast off! Zero, be sure to come back safely. Zero, zero, zero! Says the matter death return. Shall crash into the colony. Zero! Did we make it? Did it crash? Oh my god! <laughs> well, I guess I'll get the harder boss fight. <laughs> Nice. Nice. Uh, actually, I think there's an issue for, for the bad ending, so that's cool. I'll take it. Speed of the colony is increasing. It's too dangerous to stay here any longer. We better get away. Oh, but Zero, he doesn't know yet. Are you going to sacrifice him, a soldier who fought to save the Earth and all of us? Still, yeah, that's, the, that's the only time, but honestly, I'm content. I'm content. You get to get the hard part. Uh, I'm not even reading this right now. Who is this? Here? Karma hates me. Hmm? It was kind of tempting Kao to give me the bad ending, actually. That would be really funny if I did. Please answer me, I'm here, signals, I hear you. So I guess everyone just fucking almost died. Somehow. There's no ring on them, but they're alive, I believe. Signal is here, the people in data. The ring of the signals is also disappearing. Why, but I think it's lying. Get up, wake up now. You forget what you should do? Destroy it now, you can do it. You're the best of... Oh, it's Wily. You're the best of all my works. Wake up. It's incredibly strong energy. Z zero? Are you zero? What's up? Alia. Got a reading that looked like zero. You mean zero's alive? It's like zero, but not him exactly. What is this reading? It's zero, I know it is. Zero is my friend and yet... Can this really be him? If it is him, then I guess I never really knew him at all. Can it be that Zero is finally discovering his true self? What's going on? Zero! Zero is... Zero. Your... Your ex. I'll destroy you. What are you talking about? What's... Uh, why do you... Wait, 
I don't know exactly why, but I know what you're thinking. You told me once before, right? There are things that cannot be seen or analyzed correctly as data. <laughs> Sexy eyes. We have to feel. There are things that we can only feel. I feel it very strongly now. Alright. I'll accept your challenge. This is our destiny, isn't it? I'll fight. I won't run away. The Earth lies in ruins, a mere shadow of the Great Plain once was. The human race narrowly avoided extinction once and is about to face destruction again. It's happening now, it's too dangerous. No. Okay. So. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, yeah. Uh, spiky. Spike Rose Red stage. Almost forget. Uh, it's alright. Okay. Now it's time to run around and. Oh, yeah. We cannot play Zero anymore. He's gone. Yep. Time for cleanup. On aisle 3. So the Gaia armor. Slowest boss. This is the dash. It's bad. And the shot is weird. You have almost instant charge up for the charge shot. So that's neat. I think if you use like auto charge, you pretty much always have a charge shot ready. You can pretty much rapid fire charge shot with the auto charge feature. So that's neat. But other than that, really the guy armor just sucks. The only merit of the guy armor is just getting items you couldn't get before. And I feel like they knew this because with the boosted defense you could just gorilla through any any stage and not worry about anything. So you know, I feel like they knew. I feel like they really knew that this is just a utility and nothing more. Because yes, finally we are able to walk on spikes. Satisfying. Also, it's a Giga attack which sucks ass, but me. Oh, Buster Plus, that's cool. I got that, save that, continue. Alright, where is this there? Um, guess we go to Shining Firefly next. Uh, gonna be using the Fail Camp for this one. There we go. This armor should have been like fueled by weapon energy and a toggle. This armor should have just not existed, honestly. Anyways, hard tank over here. You could get this with the guy armor, but nah. It, it's really not that good. Like, you could technically beat the entire game with this, but it's really not worth it. And the fact that you pretty much need the Falcon armor to get it just shows that it's just intended for post game stuff. Nothing else. Right, let's. Uh, where's my fire weapon? There it is. I just gotta get lucky that it hits this thing. And we get our EX tank, which once again is really useless, but it's here now, so yay. Just weapon colors for the guy, but it's unused. Oh yeah, that's a thing. I mean, I guess it's just placeholder stuff. What they actually did give the guy the pass for the weapons. Ah. Alright, next up, Vault Kraken stage for another hard tank. Yeah, pretty much all the hard tanks you only get with the guy armor, which... Well, I think you can tell why Zero is gonna have problems playing alone. Oh, whoops. Because he just can't get all the hard tanks, which is why I'm going health plus with everything on Zero, just so he can stand a chance. Because, my god. Ah! Oops. Well, at least I won't have to worry about getting all the balls anymore. Oh my god. Kidding me. <laughs> and this is where I lose all my lives. But it's fine because the Raploids you gotta save will return. So no worries there. There we are. Yeah, okay. That's always close. Maybe I should have equipped Speedster for this because, my god, this is abysmally slow. Back from my dynamo looks kinda like. Oh, yeah, kinda. Guess that's interesting. Okay. 
And I guess the fact that we can't get most hard things without the guy armor means that the zero playthrough will be shorter because we don't have to do as much backtracking, so that's a plus, I guess. I guess, I'm saying because I don't know. Come on, up, up. Yeah, X really is overcompensating in the guy armor, isn't he? My god. Another thing about the guy armor shot is the reach. It has limited range. So that's fun. So, you know, it's just great. Guy armor is zero part slots. Oh my god. So I guess I can't even put speed down this if I wanted to. Fucking amazing. The heavy armor. I wonder why. I, I wonder why. I, I really wonder why. Couldn't be because it was heavy from Team Fortress 2, could it? I would never. I mean, I guess it makes sense that armor... Like a trade-off or something. Like, sure. Anyways, uh... There we go. Now I just destroy... Blocks. Push this one. So we can hit this. There we are. That's that. Safe. There we are. And I think the last thing to grab is in this stage. Yes. It's a trade of the. Oh. So this is pretty much the most involved Gaia armor puzzle in the entire game. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So let's just take care of this and... Oh yeah, you can hang on walls indefinitely with the Gaia armor, so... That's neat. Useless as fuck, but neat. So yeah. It's just... You can crush enemies with the blocks, so that's fun. Okay. Get rid of that. Yet yeah, for now, I just wanna. Okay. Uh. What? Yes, okay. okay. I think I can just push you over here, and there we go. Hard tank, that's all the collectibles. So there we go. That's that. That's pretty much it. So now it's time to face the virus realm. I'm just gonna call it the castle anyways, because why not? So I'm gonna start off with the four of armor for this first stage. Because I wanna show some more charged weapons. It's pretty much the only reason. Otherwise fighting armor would work as well. There's a one up here which bolts really well. Anyways, uh should... yeah. So this is pretty much that. And charged up it's that. And the fire. It's pretty cool, but me. Anyways, this might look familiar. You guys uh, remember Mega Man 2? I sure do. Yep. We're doing this shit again. Welcome to Quick Man Stage. Also, now in these castle stages, we have Nightmare Zero to accompany us. Or the Zero Virus, I guess. And he's a lot more aggressive, and it takes a lot less of them to absorb for you to go into danger or virus mode. So, yeah, be careful of this fucker. Right, let's see if I remember how to do this. No, I don't. I don't. <laughs> ah, well, I mean, if push comes to shove, I have Dark Hold, so who cares. Rebooted so as it is now back into murder wily mode. Now he's into wily murder mode, not murder wily. There's a difference. But yeah, he's back into murder mode, which honestly, I think that's, that's just what happened. Like, he got hit on the head and he's, he just rebooted and he's like, Oh, yeah, I got a murder shit. Oh, whoops. So, you know, good for him. Good for him. Slay, brother. Slay, brother. Okay, fuck it. I'm just gonna run or shoot. There's no point. It's like Goku. Is it? Like, I won't know. Anyone get you on the phone and tell me how Goku is. 
Oh god, no, I fuck. Fuck. Yeah. Maybe I should just use Dark Hold and be done with it. But I wanna, like, give this a legit attempt, you know. Oh god, hey guys! <laughs> that was like a gangbang. Okay. So now I just wanna pop down here. No, ah, I should have rushed. Dang it. Dang it, dang it. For beating it without using time stop. Oh. I guess I'll do that. I guess not that hard. It's just you gotta learn the pattern a bit. Which I am apparently pretty bad at, at the moment. So, you know. Great. Okay, come on. Okay. Whoop. Whoop. Ah! Dang it. <laughs> rage. Yeah, it's pretty much a rage game, just with less checkpoints. Just because fuck you, that's why. If I get to two lives, I'm gonna probably just use Starcold and be done with it. Because I wanna, like, be done with this today. Yeah, okay, let's just use Starcold and be done with it, I don't care. <laughs> fuck the achievement, I do not give a singular fuck. Because why would I? Alright. Shing! So yeah, this is still a pretty bullshit area there. Right? Anyways, now we just gotta dash past these laser generators and be done with it. There we are. So yeah, that was Quickman stage, and uh, I'd have to review my l ranking of Quickman stage, but it I don't think it really matters because this stage has hit even deeper ends now. Remember this theme? Meet Shadow Devil. He says hi and he is an asshole. He is weak against the Thunder Weapon again, just like in Mega Man 1. And I hope you enjoy your stay in this fucking shithole of hell. And I am apparently really shit at noticing the pattern right now. So that's fun. So, you know. <laughs> That's great. Okay. Ain't this fun. Oh my god. Okay. Let's come down when this stage <laughs> Yeah, I wonder why. Also, fun thing, sometimes his eye appears on his foot. For no reason. So, you know, that's fun. No reason. Just foot. Foot eye. There we are. Alright. There we are. Up, oh, time to sub tank it up. Beam. The foot doesn't really help, you know. <laughs> it's one sentence I never thought I'd say, but yeah, the foot really doesn't help. Plap sounds. Oh yeah, this this fun part now. Because no reason, just just a tiny. Fuck you to anyone who wanted to learn the pattern. Even though it has literally no pattern. So, you know, that's great. <laughs> and now it transforms into the Wily Machine number 6 and deals a shit ton of damage. 
So, you know, that's cool. At least now it exposes its eye more frequently. So that's cool. You gonna... No, okay. Ah, fine, I'll use the second one. I don't care. I don't care enough to be bothered by this at this point. So you're gonna... Now you're gonna Wily Press again. Okay. That's fine. There we go. So... I think I don't need to justify my placement of this stage, do I? Yeah, I thought this much. Yeah. Got the right idea, Alex. Got the right idea. <laughs> the trash can. G. <laughs> trash <laughs> Oh my god. Fine. You know. There we are. What else can I say about except you're welcome? <laughs> Actually, it's <see> <laughs> It just gets worse and worse, doesn't it? Uh, <laughs> anyways, uh. Fake an armor, there we go. Time for Nightmare Virus Stage 2. So. Again, remember that they tried to make this game like the finale. And they already made a Mega Man classic reference here. So now it's time to make a Mega Man X reference. Because this layout is Sigma Palace Stage 1 from Mega Man X1. Just way easier because now I can fly. So, you know. Yeah, this is pretty much that stage, just ripped off everything that made it that stage and replaced with crushers and enemy spam and viruses and absolute pain and suffering so you know it's, it's got that going for it which is cool absolute absolutely cool really. did this stage make the i don't think it did at least i don't remember that much i think you're Thinking of Dark Necrobat stage, which had intentional lag for some reason. Which I still don't get, but yeah, it's probably what you're thinking of. So some health would be nice, eventually. Just so I can refill my hub subtings a bit. Yeah, it's a horrible way to set up the series. Yeah, they took the worst boss from Mega Man 1 and made it even worse, and you know. Uh, that's that's how you that's how you build a series farewell. Maybe they were so embarrassed by it, like this that they made X6 to apologize, but then X6 just it it was X6. That's all I can say about that. Gaia armor may be good for this stage, but you know, boss. It's also a thing. And besides, I feel like the Falcon armor is better because you could just skip the entire platforming section at the start, so. That's just great. Like, but what do you want? I'm gonna just skip a stage. Just kept on making it behind the team's back. Oh yeah, that was a thing. So that's fun! <laughs> like, high, high intensity. Does it? Oh, it's just used the weaknesses and that was pretty much it. Huh. So... A very annoying boss from X1? Yep, it's time! Rang the bang the W! Because fuck you! Uh god, now I gotta like remember all the weaknesses of this. I think you can find. Never see this thing. Yeah, it's the second boss in X1 in the castle. Also, this sun thing is like the most cramped boss thing ever. 
And it spikes on top of the bell as well. That's like the only reason guy armor makes this easy, I think. But imagine those boss spiders. Again! Fucking boss spider again! God, I would lose my mind. I guess you aren't weak to that. Was it just crescent shot? No, it was, okay. But I know the sun nose is weak to Goo Shaver, so that much I know. Okay. There we are. Yeah, I don't know how you're supposed to hit that guy a lot, but sure. I guess I'll take Crescent Shot as the weakness of all, everything here. Oh god, I'm getting pummeled. That ain't good. Well, let's just take that and it's not gonna help a lot. Whatever. Oh great, this! Because we needed to make this even stupider. Okay. Alright, I can't charge up my weapons, I forgot. Fucking prime. There we are. Right, now let's just get to Goo Shaver and kill the fucking nose. Yeah, the, the nose goes down in no time, which is really dickish because... Yeah. The arena stays cramped once you kill the nose, which is horrible. It's not as bad as the next one, because I think the spikes at least go away, but still, it's, it's bad. Pretty bad. Still SA rank of, of Hunter, that's cool. So, yay, that was... That was certainly a thing, wasn't it? Hey! <laughs> Why the stage was a clusterfuck, it wasn't as offensively bad as the rest of the F tier, so I'm gonna say low E. Alright, so... And it's time for the only use Unarmored X will ever have ever again, pretty much. So, there we go! Virus stage 3! Where well, you wanna be unarmored for a certain reason that will make the last stage so much more manageable and... It's still gonna be awfully tedious and horrible, but at least a tiny bit less. Maximal rank is GA and it's actually useless. That's great. I love me. I love me save some useless ranks. Alright, so. Okay. Oh my god. At least this stage is doable with regular X. Except this jump is ugh, horrible. Anyways. Hey Dr. Light. I never expected you to come here without the armor. But it's very dangerous to go without adequate equipment. To finish this battle, I'll give you the ultimate armor. You can perform the Giga attack unlimited times. But don't get lazy and depend too much on the power of the armor. The end is near. Good luck X. So, you think we get equipped with the ultimate armor right now? Nope. Either game over right now, or just beat the stages on armor legs. Guess I'll try, I've got two lives. It's probably not gonna happen. No Street Fighter moves, just unlimited giga attacks. We have abandoned Street Fighter forever now. So, you know, let's go. Cool. So here we are. D fight. X. I'm very happy now. I've never been so happy. My mind is becoming very clear. As though I have known everything. I don't care about the Mavericks anymore. 
All I have to do is one thing. Zero. You're zero, aren't you? Yes, he fucking is! <laughs> yes, the energy readings are still the same. And there's no Maverick reading, is there? You're reading my normal data. This is my true form as of me. It seems so. The data readings are the same as zero used to be. Still, you're not visible and cannot be analyzed correctly as data. You taught me that, Zero. I feel something evil within you. Some, or, or should I say something more evil than Sigma? Then I don't need to give you any more explanations. I'll destroy you, whatever you are. And bring back the true Zero! Sorry, X, but this is true Zero! Look at that elf! Oh my god! Okay, 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 okay. I know you can cheese this theme, uh, this boss fight somehow if you cheese him with the Giga attack, but uh, I don't remember how to do it properly. So you know, expect me to die twice more and then equip the ultimate armor and say fuck you, Zero. <laughs> Meanwhile, you can enjoy the theme. Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh, okay. I've never seen that before. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Well, let me... I don't even, I don't even remember if Zero has any weaknesses here, so I mean... He's Awakened Zero's me. So I guess... I don't ever remember fighting Awakened Zero, actually, now that I think about it. My god, he, he deals damage like a truck to an armored X. Yeah, okay. So, stage selection. We got the ultimate armor. There we are. And let's ultimate armor our way out of this. Easy. Easy. So we, just, we gotta do a stage again, but just really not that bad, I guess. Especially with ulti armor. I even be able to get like a couple of health thingies for my sub tank. Yeah, there we are. Lovely. Where's I'm gonna exit thing outside of the stupid secret? Only the stupid secret. That's the only reason, really. It really adds nothing, except for challenge runs, which, you know. Sure, knock yourself out, mate. So yeah, that's the Giga Attack. Awesome. Really also nice for speed running. Get used to seeing the Giga Attack a lot in the next stage, by the way. Yank, 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 yank. Uh, the blue rings and one more thing, which one, just so you can see it. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Mm. I mean, then again, X7 and X8 start you off with armor, armorless X, so you know. Yeah. yeah. Oh, hello, Mega X50. Thank you for joining the stream. Yeah, true, they have the Adash. So, I could just cheese the whole fight like, oh my god, I could really just cheese the fight again. Let's not. Let's see if it does the other attack, maybe. And not just his giga attack ten more times, come on, Zero. Like, I know it's effective, but can you, like, stop? Stall for two minutes, why would I do that? Okay, fuck it. No stalling, I don't want it again. There we go. Fuck it. It's probably nothing too spectacular anyways. It's fine. Like, he still hits like a truck, which is wild. Ah! 
Mm. I thought I won. I didn't expect you to do that. I never expected you to use Soul Body. Ah, yes, yeah, Soul Body X Machina from X4. Mm -hmm. I'm losing consciousness. Genmu series of one shot in his. Oh, that's horrible. X. X. <laughs> You've done very well, X. I will make you uh, end easy. No, I want it, are you too? I know everything you're trying to do. Then be a good boy and just die! Ooh, ooh, ah, X, X, please survive. Survive, X, live for me. You would almost fully evolve to your true self. It's a shame you didn't quite make it, Zero. You had so... Goy. Why Why did Goy get... <laughs> censored? Oh well. Farewell! Well, it's only you and now, X. I'll let you live this time. But I won't be so kind next time. And there will be a next time. See you soon. You, the strongest reploid. Wahaha. <laughs> <laughs> eh? God, horror, horror. Can't see anything. Zero, don't leave. Please stand by me. I'll protect you. Zero, now Zero's dead. <sighs> so, there we are. So, I'm getting a strong energy ring from this point. Yeah, Sigma. <laughs> What was, uh, soul body was the weapon you got from split mushroom which let you create a uh, duplicate of yourself all right uh, as much as everyone always raves about this fight and stuff uh, mm. the stage itself at least it was friendly to unarmored X but it was pretty underwhelming Uh, Seb, it was just a cop-out attack, so they both would faint at the same time, pretty much. It's pretty dumb. Even though Zero could never actually learn Soul Body in X4. So... You know. Anyways, uh... God, where did I put Zero? Like... Is the fight really that good? Oh yeah, it did... Oh yeah, he does. But then, like, like he do also uses it if he, if we j don't get that from. Yeah, uh, 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 horrible. So, anyways, I guess it's gonna go in. Sure, sure. Low C. I think that's fine. I think that's fair. <laughs> right. Now it's time for absolute pain. Let the bit rate die! Yeah, this background is fucking ridiculous and my bit rate always dies when I try to record this. So, remember, Bubble Man? This is pretty much Bubble Man's section from Mega Man 2 again. Boy, they really like Mega Man 2, didn't they? Sigma's dance party, yep. Yeah, he, he, he's on it. He's, he's on a rave. Alright. Yeah, ultimate arm. Oh! Of course there's spikes there. Wow, it's like I never even died. Wow, amazing. <laughs> fucking, fucking amazing. Alright, yoink. Oh god! Okay, let's maybe not spam Giga Attack. <laughs> My god. Chimp go around me? What? What are you talking about? Many. How about. Because he was shit's going on here, yeah. Like you're just gonna you're going blind in this stage, and then there's just enemies spawning out of nowhere as well because fuck you. Like it's, it's pretty great, honestly. It's pretty fucking great. Get a one up, get some health, lovely. And as we all know, it's time for the boss rush. So I want you just to take a minute and soak in the HP bars. Well, I do something for a second.
Yeah. Who pinged me? Oh, I see. Thanks, Adam. Okay. So, yeah. I think you got enough time to soak in the health bus there. Yeah? And this is why I wanted the ultimate armor. So I could just go through these fights and cheese them hard. But still, Burn Dynorex is weak against... What's it called again? Wing, sp wing Spiral. Because wind puts out fire. Except when it doesn't and just fans fire more oxygen. But let's not talk about that. Suppose my noise to get both HP to get to level 90. Hmm. That was great. So now imagine doing this with the weaknesses, which don't do as much damage and leave the boss boss's hit stun for way longer, making the fights go even longer, and yeah. 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 Alright. Dark Necrobat is weak against Firefly Laser. Because fireflies are light and he is a bat and darkness, so you know. Yeah, why not? It it works, it makes sense. It just makes sense. So yeah, this is the most mindless boss rush ever because you either have the funky ultimate armor or you use the weaknesses and spend like ten hours on this. It's it's either or You poor soul, Omega, you poor soul. Why would you? Why would you? <laughs> that is like the worst thing you could ever do. Well, good for you, but I don't think most people would. Because that sounds horrible. Yeah, Sigma, st oh, Sigma Stage 1. It is possible, but it's horrible. It's quite horrible, indeed. Yes, exactly. It's horrible. So, Shining Firefly is weak against Tri Thunder because, well, he's a flying type, I guess. Or, like, the lightning disturbs his light or something? Yeah, I don't know. Like, it, it, it makes sense somewhat, but it's also kind of weird if you think about it too hard, which means don't think about it. Yeah, getting early that means you don't have weapons, so that's just great. <sighs> horrible. Utterly horrible. But I mean, what else do you expect? It's this game. Thunder would make sense for It would have. I don't know why Pegasus is weak against Time Stop, but eh, whatever. Volt Kraken is weak against Goo Shaver because. And I guess the water makes him more conductive and it shocks himself. Yeah, sure. Let's go with that. So the fun thing about Vault Kraken, his arena is pretty short, so he can just <laughs> giga attack from wall to wall and just combo. <laughs> That's pretty fun. Yeah, that's kinda enjoyable, honestly. I don't even have to touch the bottom of the screen anymore. Haha. <laughs> nice. Alright, give me more health for my sub tanks. And four more. Oh! Spiral Pegasus is weak against Time Stop for no reason. That's it. No reason. Fuck you. You don't, you don't get an explanation. Also, you really do not have enough time stop for the weakness to actually be able to kill him in like any reasonable time, so, you know. Just gotta make do with your ultimate attack. Also, I think if you use the Giga attack during time stop, it actually cancels the time stop, which is weird. Could the game is enjoyed? What's that? The devs, probably. Yeah, they just didn't give a shit or that. X5, a rush job. Absolutely. Absolutely. I'm so good, I don't need ground. <laughs> X. <laughs> yeah. X knows what's up. Alright. 
It feels rushed. It feels so rushed. And like they spent their energy in all the wrong places. Like all the alia dialogue, which is totally useless. So, sp Spiky Rose Red is weak against the fire attack. I don't, I don't remember the name. Because plant, fire, what more you want? Like that's like the simplest weakness in the entire game, and I approve. The old joke. Oh, bring back an old joke. I am ready to hear nostalgic jokes. <laughs> I'll probably get 9 viewers just watching me beat up this shitty ass boss rush. <laughs> oh boy. Rockman is bruised with a rose petal. <laughs> Crescent Grizzly is weak against Spike Ball. Because bears get pricked by prickly forms when they try to go through the woods? Yeah, okay. Beats ground types. He's more of a moon type, but I guess we don't have a moon type in Pokemon. Like Lunatone is psychic, but also part rock. Hmm. That's weird. There's dark, yeah. Hmm. I mean, moon is more moonlight, not dark. Oh, whatever. Duff McWhalen is a shitty name. Tidal Whale is weak against Crescent Slash. Because, well, I don't know, we needed something. And it's actually recommended to use that here because Giga Attack will only land you on the spikes. So, you know, that's my recommendation for you. And, like, it actually isn't that bad to use against him here. Like, it actually works, especially the charge shield. It's pretty useful. Like, the damage is very, very acceptable. I don't mind this. You know, it's just second hand sunlight. It is, it is. That's that's the that's the thing. So you know. Then I'll overstrike the boss rush. Oh god. Oh that that almost got bad. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. That's great. Almost went horrible. Love it. Isn't a bad boss to use Gaiama, but just... Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's just how it is. So, yeah, that was the boss rush. It was horrible, and I regret ever... Yeah, there we are! Finally! The only good thing to come out of this. Let's update the 1-up drops. One out of one in this game, hey! Yeah, seven there. Nice! Ding! Finally, took a while. So now we can just kind of rush through here with Giga Attack. We can get over here, just get some big health for sub I guess. Uh -huh. Yeah, the X series is very. Yeah, it actually dropped, which is wild. Yeah, the X series is very p picky. Also, just when you thought they were gone. Why bring them back again? Like, why? Why would you? Uh, absolutely horrible. Yeah, they look neat, but it's the Oko blocks. Hate them. Like this backdrop, though. It's the best game in the history of all the <laughs> Yeah. For better or for worse, mostly for worse. Hey, Sigma. <laughs> Impressive, the number one Reploid you are. You came much earlier than expected. Make out of that what you will. Why? Why did you do this? Because I'm a dick. Because of Zero. To waken Zero from his false self. What? 
I have conducted further research and reached a tremendous result. I wanted to find out what Zero truly is and scatter the virus all over the earth to purify his body. But the amount of the virus was insufficient. So I used the random colony, making it a virus colony, and let it land on the earth. <laughs> you know the outcome, don't you? You almost annihilated the earth for that? You're sick. Fortunately, there are those handy guys called Maverick Hunters, ever ready and able to come to the rescue. And I knew the earth would be safe and sound. But alas, most of the hunters have also become Mavericks. <laughs> That was a close one! <laughs> you! How many hunters have been lost because of you? I'll never forgive you for this! You're going to pay for what you've done! So... Weird ass decides Sigma is weak against Drive Hunter, I think. And yeah, he's... Uh, that's actually a move from X1, I think he does there, so yeah. Actually kinda weird of a pattern sometimes he does here. Nope. Okay. Ah! Still does a lot of damage compared to like everything else right now. Okay. There. You're gonna use the other attack that I know you can do or not? Oh fuck off! Don't spawn on top of me, you dick. Fucking hell. Absolute asshole. Okay. I really should just giga attack the bitch right now. There we are. Crap, come here. Well, we're not done yet. <laughs> the number one hunter you are, X. The stronger you are, the more I want to destroy you. I was It was pointless to have Zero fight you. After all, you are the number one hunter. You show no mercy for enemies or comrades. Shut up! Where are you? Here I am! You can challenge me at any time! I have delightful news. I have recently acquired a new partner. He has been very supportive. He seems to have created quite a few robots. And he gave me the toughest body that you'll ever see. You got here sooner than I expected, so it's not yet complete. But it is enough to defeat you! He's an excellent partner. I believe you two know each other. In fact, he used to be a comrade of yours. He was very persistent about you, and that makes him very helpful to me. You see, X, there's someone other than me who hates you! I feel a combined rage and die, but not before suffering horribly. <laughs> Goodbye, X! So, yeah, giant hand, robot, thingy, Sigma. And it's heavily implied that uh, I got crushed. Thanks. Well, whatever. It's heavily implied that the mysterious dude who Sigma got a partnership with is Wily. Not sure how, but it is probably Wily. With how he words it all. So, you know. That's a thing. Somehow Wily's still alive. I don't know why. But he is. Yeah, like, Wily's probably an eye. Uh, he just doesn't show himself, which... Fucking hell, Wily. Why don't you make Wily capsules for Zero? That would really help, you know? But I guess he didn't want to copy light or something. There we go. <laughs> Not lab code person. It's actually April boss screwed on top. It really is? Oh my god. That is horrible. Why well, they already make cancer as well, just destroys the very game? <laughs> I could believe it. Anyways, gotta say, this theme is actually pretty cool, so... I can't give the theme that much. So this... 
uh, is also actually weak against the spike ball, but why would you use it when you can just Giga Attack, you know? Like at this point, just Giga Attack everything and you'll be done. That's how you beat the game. Okay. Ow. The boss does a rock stare. What? Grrr! Darn! But I'll never die alone! I'll take Zero down with me! No, stop using Zero as a shield! <laughs> Isn't it painful to have to watch while others suffer? You can put up with your own pain. But can't bear to see others, especially Zero harmed, can you? I'm taking Zero, the one most important to you! To the underworld. Goodbye, Hex. <coughs> Ow! Ow! Ah, my throat! <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> Jesus! I didn't expect that! My god! <laughs> Not yet. Actually, I want you to rest and relax for now. Hold on, X. Just for a few more moments. Forget all the painful memories. One week! He got repaired in one week, that's fast. X, don't you remember anything about what happened? You're still on about that? The answer is no, I don't remember anything. You see, you and Zero are both special A-level hunters for all, you, all to see. You worked together and solved a lot of problems. I remember Sigma. His name doesn't leave me. But I don't have any memory of Zero. Maybe whoever repaired me deleted the data by mistake. Did... Did he really delete your memory? Hey, stop it now. You better think it's a miracle that X came back safely. It truly is a miracle. Not only did he come back, but without so much as even a scratch. It's hard to repair the bodies of X and Zero because they're still a mystery. It's not a miracle, I bet. You never believe it's a miracle. I'm not interested in miracles. I don't think Reploids dream of miracles either. But why was only Zero's memory data deleted from X? I have no idea. Maybe it disappeared by itself? Otherwise it was deleted on purpose. Besides, there's a protection now. He won't even accept data related to Zero. I couldn't program such a protection. I've got another mystery about X. X, although it will take time, I think this battle will lead to peace. It will! We need to work harder for that. For peace. What is your private dream? Huh? I've never thought about it. Well... I got it. I want to create Elysium. Elysium? Yes! It's a paradise where the human race coexists with Reploids peacefully. Yes. That is my dream. I'd like to create Elysium. Someday in the near future. I wish Zero were here. Huh? You're really talking about Zero again? N no, nothing. Elysium. Maybe I should call it... Neo Arcadia. Oh yes, I'll do it someday. And that was the bad ending of Mega Man X5. I didn't think I would get that this time, but Jesus. So, yeah, this was actually supposed to lead into Mega Man Zero if they didn't make X6. Where X was actually supposed to be the bad guy, not just copy X, exactly. Which honestly I think would have been way more interesting, but they had to retcon everything back around with X6 and... Yeah, the rest is history. My god. My fucking god, this game. I... Ugh. I do a rookie hunter and he shoot the cannon. Why would I? No, 
I'm not doing that now. I got the bad ending. I think if I have to summarize the good ending, it's Cyrus still dies, but he never turns into a full fucking psychopath. So X and Cyrus just have a tussle over like. X thinks Zero has gone mad, Zero thinks that's ridiculous, so they just fight and Zero still throws himself over against Sigma and at the end Zero still dies. I think Light still repairs X, doesn't wipe the memory of Zero though. And yeah, I think then X is like, yeah, we have to rebuild society because the space colony still did create a lot of mess down here. And he actually has Zero Saber in the ending there, which is pretty cool. Yeah, so put up a... Do you... Uh, actually, Adam... <laughs> do ghosts... I mean, it's not a ghost of Dr. Light, it's like the AI that suddenly was able to fix... Act. It's still fucking weird that Light can still do that suddenly? Like... Why? Like... I don't get it. Anyways, Adam, if you can find a video of the god ending and just throw it in gaming or something, that would be great. So that we could watch that real quick. But yeah. Boom. The writing is utter horse shit. Yeah, it is utter horse shit. There is so much ass pulling here. Not only the fact that Sigma suddenly knew Wily and Wily built him a body. But also that light suddenly can just become corporeal and fix X up. And in the bad ending even just erase Zero's memories. Like, what in the fuck? This is just... I don't know what the fuck they smoked while writing this, but the story just totally fell apart at the end. It really makes it hard to have the whole game believable at this point. Yeah, it was supposed to be an ending. An ending to a series. Why would you end a series on so many ass pulls? And idiotic writing choices. Like, what even is this? I know I'm not here to really rank the story of these games, but my god, the story of this game fails in so many levels. Like, it's incredible how badly written this is. Like, yeah, that's the thingy. Cool. It's in, thanks. There's so many ways they could have made it. Yeah, exactly. They could have made it flow so much nicer, but they just didn't do any of that. Okay, uh, it's in. Let me just do that. Oh, oh god, ow. Loud, loud. Okay, let me just open that in a new tab real quick. Let me just... Uh, let me just see if I can... Oh god, uh, give me a second, I gotta fumble about this. Uh, how do I do this, how do I do this? Uh, add a new source, window capture, add source... Quick... This is we've got X layer of the commander mission. That is true. There we go, good ending. That's what I wanted, uh, I think. Yeah. Just crunch that down real quick. Okay, uh, fit to screen. There we are. Alright, let me just put that below that. That. Okay. So, let's see. <laughs> Loud. So, yeah, blah, blah. Skip some of that, blah 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 blah. So, yeah, this is zero dice. Zero? Oh, em emulator lag now, the nice. Zero! 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 No! Don't die! Yeah, too late for that. Do you hear me? Zero! Zero! D drop that! Uh oh, no! Yep, everyone fucking dies. How persistent you are. Die, Sigma. Sigma when you become soup. 
X, X, do you hear me? Drown your optimism, lads. To your own demise, you should l live. Well, he's still pretty tattered, but not as much as in the bad ending. And yeah, light still says the same thing there. Hold on, X, blah, 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 just for a few more moments. And there we are. Three years from then! Which also isn't true because uh, X6 only takes place like three weeks later or something. So that makes no sense. Oh, maybe I'm still covered with bias glasses, but I don't really see what's wrong with the plot. Suddenly knowing what is random, and he's trying being in X and coming to remember X. Being in a show is kind of dumb and just this. Yeah, see, it's dumb. Like, you can't just pull the funny, haha, the AI can suddenly move and fix robots and build robots out of your ass. Like, that's a. It's not a retcon per se, but it's just. You don't just add this to any. Like, to. Especially, like, in the moment where they're about to die. You can't just add the funny ghost that fixes everything and makes everything good again. You know? It's. Ugh. Anyways. Large Maverick has broken out in Hori Hor block. Yeah, going to actually immediately. Let's go now. Get a move on. We've been used to living in peace. Since that time, Captain Nexus' eyes have changed and sharpened. I can face any enemy now. I feel this way as long as I have the saber. I'll do it today, Zero. With you, forever we'll be together, Zero. God, this guy's emulator is lagging beyond belief. Jesus Christ, that's horrible. So, I guess that's... Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. So that's that. Uh, there we go, get back over that. It's kind of questionable why light has six different armors, so I probably would have to explain what was in it. I mean, like, uh, light made eggs and then put him into testing for, like, a few years, so he probably had enough time to make some armors for him while then. I don't know. X dropped it down the toilet. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, all in all, I... I mean, yeah, Light is a fucking machine, you know? Anyways, uh, this stage, my god, it... Bad, 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 bad. The boss was just bad. Wow, this tier list turned out really ugly. <laughs> I'm not gonna give the full ranking until we did Zero's playthrough, but... Gnarly! Wow! 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 Well, let me just up the tally by one real quick. That's 107 now. It smells like E to you. <laughs> Well, anyways, uh, that's, oh, hey, we got a funny screen there. Wow, I was, so, so, before we do anything else, let's just quickly show the training stage, because why not? Why not? So, let's see what this is about. Like, I don't think I ever played the training stage here, so... Hmm. I can do the ultimate armor code in the training stage. <laughs> nice, just... Just totally abolish the training stage, huh? Oh god, hey! Oh, those enemies from X4, okay, I didn't think that would happen. Uh, I'm gonna try to low damage the stage portion of this. Yeah, yeah, watch, I'm spared over. Yeah, I can't shoot through walls, that's fine. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, dash, okay, yeah. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. Okay, that was kind of satisfying. I think all the enemies are satisfying. Ah, fair enough. Oh god. Hmm. 
Okay, even as a like training stage, this doesn't really feel that tutorial. Mm. Like, what does this? This teaches me that Alia will never shut up and never stop interrupting me, huh? Wow, that was pretty bad. Also, I think yes, shut up. I think Magma Dragoon here actually has a weakness, which is yeah, because no, she didn't. But that doesn't matter because Endgame should not be bothered anymore. So yeah, Magma Dragoon actually has a weakness, I think, in the Spike Ball, which is kind of weird and random, but sure. Oh, ah. Almost did it no damage. Dang it. Didn't know he would do the fucking jump kick. Ah. Dang it. Dang it. Ah, whatever. Spike was made from leftover code of twin. <laughs> that would explain it. That would explain it. My god. So, that was something. Does it change my view of anything? No. Absolutely not. So, that's a thing. My god. My god. This stage was S <laughs> uh, So yeah, one last look at the tier list. Mm. Mm. 